Um, the, the usual formula is injury, as I said, arising out of or in the course of employment, and the very significant case in relation to that was a High Court decision of Kavanaugh, which was decided in 1960. The importance of that case is it basically showed how broad that concept of um, injury by accident was. And if those of you are familiar with the case of Kavanaugh, the significance of it was that the worker in that instance actually, um, he came to work, he was feeling ill. Um, it was not part of his work process. He went to the toilet, he wanted to vomit, in fact vomited so violently that he ruptured his esophagus. Uh, and consequently he, he died as a consequence of that uh, ruptured esophagus. His widow made a claim uh, based on the fact that he'd suffered an injury arising out of or uh, arising out of in the course of his employment. The High Court said this was not a matter which arose out of his employment. There was no work relationship with the rupture of his esophagus, but because it took place at work, it arose in the course of his employment. So that, I think, commenced um, some fairly broad interpretations. And in the context of stress, what that means is that there are a range of stress matters which will fall within the definition of traumatic injury by accident, such as the PTSD situations where people have witnessed traumatic events, specific traumatic events, for example, or they have been involved in a fight or an assault, particularly important for police, for example, who bring stress claims not based on injury by ac uh, sorry, not based on disease, but based on injury by accident. So these are the kinds of things will be included in this sort of category. The injury by accident people will be those who have been assaulted or witnessed assaults, traumatic events, hold-ups, train crashes. So those in the banking industry would be familiar that um, with the hold-up situation, often people are not claiming as disease-based claims, but they're actually claiming as injury by accident claims. Now, the significant change I said in the 1980s was we introduced the concept of disease-based claims. The, the typical formula for this, and it's fairly common throughout most jurisdictions, is this broad notion of ailment, disease, disorder, defect, a morbid condition. The essence of this is it's basically talking about grand, gradual onset, so it's quite different from injury by accident because even though Kavanagh's case said that you can have incidents which are not actively related to your work, um, they did say that you still need a specific identifying event to fall within that category. The difference between this and disease is that disease allows for a gradual onset condition. And that's very really significant for the way that we look at things because those who have been practicing in the jurisdictions where disease was introduced in the 1980s know that they could then bring claims for people who had conditions such as RSI, um, which, for want of a better expression, and now more recently throughout the 90s stress became prominent. And those claims could be bought because they were gradual onset conditions and prior to that time essentially they would have been excluded from the legislation. Now the, the problem with a lot of these things, and if you cast your mind back to the onset of RSI, and I was practicing uh, during the 80s when there was a significant rise in that, those kinds of conditions, legislators had great difficulty in trying to deal with that, um, and they didn't actually specifically deal with the RSI problem as such. Uh, but there was a lot of strategy to try and deal with it in the sense of some fairly robust decision making, some fairly strict claims management to try and in a sense stamp it out. And one way of doing that was sending people to medical practitioners who didn't believe in that medical condition and getting medical reports saying this person has got nothing wrong with them. In, the relation, in relation to stress actually it's been dealt with in different ways. 